Kieran, good minutes in the legs today for the lads and a really good win. Yeah, uh, another good challenge, a step up in the, the opponent again and uh, yeah, really good workout. Um, it was a tough game, we managed to get minutes into lots of players, there were some good improvements on things from last week that we wanted to improve on. We had spells where we dominated the game with our, with our pressing and managed to pin them in their half and then we had spell you know later in the game where we had to see the game out and show you know resilience and two qualities that we're definitely going to need to show and uh, the boys showed that today um no injuries i don't think on what was probably a pretty dangerous surface with the with the downpour and the rain that's been in the last 24 hours so to come through it with any without touch with any big issues a big positive yeah it must be quite nice for you that it's all in all fairly comfortable kind of game I'd say given the level of the opponents the team that's going to be playing in the Europa League next year and, and they didn't really I think threaten too much till the latter stage as you seem to control it quite well yeah look I wouldn't say it was comfortable I thought it was a it was a hard fought game but um, yeah certainly first half we managed to play the, the majority of the game in the opposition's half which is always nice and same at the start of the second half we managed to play the majority of the game in their territory for the first 15 20 minutes and I say last 20 25 minutes we had to we had to defend together as a team lots of substitutions tired legs and we saw that bit of the game out well as well so uh, yeah look we again we never read anything or we we don't place importance on the result in particular of the of the pre-season games we want to see progression and certainly saw progression in some things from from the last couple of weeks yeah set pieces crucial you got the goal from one short corner worked quite well today but that a few times a few kind of long the balls over to Jacob Grease for example it could be a, a key outlet in the Premier League it's going to be massive for us no yeah. doubt about it we you know our set player record's been excellent the last couple of years from an attacking sense especially but defensively strong as well um and yeah, we're going to have to have it as a, as a source of goals for sure. We're going to get less set pieces. We're going to get less corners, less set pieces in the final third. So we have to optimise them as, as well as we possibly can against teams who are going to be even better organised. So it's a big challenge. And if we can you know, still contribute goals from set players in different ways, it'll be big for us. So nice to get one today. Yeah, good to have Amari back into some competitive pre-season action. Yeah, very important. Um, he's yeah missed a little bit of time. But he's, he's a fit boy, so no real concerns over his readiness. So it's just about getting him you know, 45 minutes on the pitch after a good training week and he comes through it no problem, so uh, he can build up again next week. Yeah, and Wes managed to get a 45, so I assume that the ankle roll he had last week couldn't have been too bad? Uh, no, look, he's, he's not trained until yesterday, a partial session really. Um, so we, we haven't had him and a couple of other players for the week, so we have been really light in numbers, but... We managed to train with a, with a bigger group yesterday, Wes being part of that, so he was able to get some minutes and no problems in the ankle, so it's positive. And no George Hurst with the group today, can you give us an update with that one? Yeah, George has got an issue, um, a knock from the or an issue from the game last weekend, so he's not been with us this week. He's, he's seeing some specialists and we can't update on the definite timeline yet, but we'll do as, as soon as we can.